Hey, Dan. What's the one thing that everybody loves? Shining! Fire! Scatological pornography. <laughs> no. Red alls. <laughs> what do you call a dream date with a fish? Dad, don't do this. Sam enchanted evening. Yay! <laughs> I'm gonna use these riddles to break the ice with the other members of the drill team. Once I gain their confidence through humor, I'll destroy the drill, save hell, and we can all finally go home. Yay, riddles! I've got a riddle, everybody. What's 16 years old and gets hotter every day? A Jonas brother? Oh! <laughs> I think the one with diabetes is the sweetest. I think Tina was referring to... Our marriage! Ta-da! <laughs> I've got a very special surprise planned for our anniversary, Bobby. Ooh, surprises make me crazy. In a good way. What's green and well-rested and leaving with riddles? Me! This is a story about a demon from hell. His job was torture. He tortured so well. One day he watched some illegal TV and Satan launched the earth to save hell from a drill that could destroy them permanently. These are your neighbors from hell. You are neighbors from hell. We are your neighbors from hell. <laughs> hey, Chev, Dad. You know, I was just thinking. Riddles are a great way to meet people. And we're such good bros that I'd love to bro down more with your drill team through the magic of riddlery. Why did the spider go on the computer? To check his website. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love these riddles, son. And I know the team will, too. Live, D-Bags. I'm back from my honeymoon with my latest future ex-wife. Allegra and I spent two weeks in the Australian outback hunting baby kangaroos. Nothing says till death do us part like jamming TNT into a joey pouch. Boom, that's love. I give it a month. You jackals ready for our big EPA circle jerk? Do I have time to use the restroom first? I, I drank way too much Sunny D this morning. Hurry up, boy. And you're gonna wanna use the restroom on the women's lib floor downstairs. We had a fecal freak out this morning. It looks like a chocolate factory in there. One you don't want a golden ticket to. No offense, Shevdev. Ah, uh, excuse me, which one of these is the men's bathroom? This one looks like a chef holding cantaloupes, and, and this one resembles a doctor doing Pilates. It's pretty obvious. Have your patriarchal ways blinded you that much? Cantaloupes, Pilates, cantaloupes, Pilates, cantaloupe! Ah. Dinkles, 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 dinkles. Mmm, mama likey. Take a seat, everyone. The EPA is sending over their top dog to review our plan for the marshland. So, I want all paper cups and plastic bottles and deodorant off the table and in the trash. Men, put on those hemp vests. Women. Oh, who am I kidding? This is an executive meeting. There are no women here. But there is one vagina, right, Marty? <sighs> Excuse me, did someone say vagina? Alex, you old war bitch. Keep it in your pants, Don, or I'll bite it off for good. Let me get my papers out of my lady briefcase and get this party started. Don, your plan to build preschools on toxic marshlands can lick my outbox. We refuse approval and demand you relocate immediately. Alex, this is a very important project for us. Now, everybody's got a prize. Hit me with yours. Don, if you don't shut your face, I'll beat you with my beaver. His name's Terry, and he's in a terrible mood. Aren't you, Terry? Oh, that reminds me. I owe Bill Clinton a call. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm, I'm allergic to beaver. Sounds familiar, huh, Marty? Hey, wild hog. We meet again. Do we know each other? Yeah, you were hanging your rat in the lady's hand sink. I find that bold and intriguing. 
I tell you what, Don, I changed my mind. Send the big guy here to pitch me in private, and I'll consider your marshland proposal. Now, if you excuse me, I have to go spank my beaver. He ate my Luna bar. Bad, Terry. Hot corn! All right, Hellman, you heard the man. Get your pitching panties on. But, sir, I, I don't know anything about the marshland project. Why me? Don't know, don't care. Get it done or you're fired. Ah, oh, for the love of Ray J. So, as you can see, the Petromondo Preschool would be ideally situated on these super safe, cancer free marshlands. Like this. Tell me more, but sit on my lap. We spent lots of time and money cleaning up this land after that little nuclear mishap last spring. Hey, look. What does it seem like these two figurines are doing? Trying to start a fire with their hips? Well, that's one way of putting it. This one looks like it has jelly donut on it. Let me clean it off for you. Yeah, that's getting clean. I'll suck the paint right off this preschool figurine. You know what I'm saying, right? Uh, not really. Oh, no, the figurine's cold. I better warm it up in my jungle cave. Yeah, spelunk away, little figurine. Um, anyway, back to the marshlands. Yeah, you want to talk about marshlands? Why don't you clean up my marshlands? You can start with the bat problem. Oh, mm, yeah. Uh, uh, want to hear a riddle? I don't care. Just keep talking. Okay, this is a good one. What kind of bank has no money? Washington Mutual. Well, here's a riddle for you. What has two thumbs, is hot and bothered, and has a plastic figurine in her uterus that she wants to replace with your figurine in exchange for EPA approval of those marshlands? Ah. Uh... This guy. Brigade, guess who scored tickets to witness an execution for our anniversary tomorrow night? Me! It'll be just like our first date. Remember how we watched Andy Gibb get tortured by his own music? And you held my hand for the first time? That was the most romantic night of my life. Yeah, yeah, that, that, that was fun. Hey, I thought you'd be more excited. I thought he'd be more excited too, frankly. Uncle Flartog and I even learned a song. Love is the love I love the loveliest. You are my love. I love the loveliest. Woo! Sorry, guys. Awesome jam. It's just that something really weird happened at work today. Me and my stupid riddles. Yeah, this string cheese should come with a Surgeon General's warning. May drop too many underpants. Balthazar, what are you talking about? I'm supposed to make love to a business associate tomorrow night or else I get fired. Ooh, new idea for a song goblin. Panty drop, panty drop, panty drop fever. No, panty, oh. panty drop, oh, wee panty drop fever. Ooh. Let's rock that riff in the kitchen. Well, that's all right. We'll just do an execution another time. I can't have sex with some giant random business lady. Oh, it's fine, Balthy. It's for the mission. Just do it and get it over with. Humans still haven't discovered the real way to have sex anyways. I'll be cheating. I'll feel so guilty. Fine. Listen, if it makes you feel better, I'll just take DeAndre to the execution and have sex with him. What? Who's DeAndre? I like playing tennis with your family. He's giving us all lessons. It's so fun. Forty love! Ain't nothing wrong with your ground strokes, girl. You don't need to sleep with DeAndre. I won't feel guilty. I know you, Balthy. You're gonna feel guilty, and then I'm gonna feel guilty that you're feeling guilty because I didn't have the guts to go and throw down with DeAndre. What? Damn it, Balthy. I love you. And my anniversary gift to you is plowing DeAndre to kingdom come. Thank you. What are you guys doing? The goblin keeps fussing that it's so much colder here than hell. I thought we'd warm him up while making popcorn. Turn it up the heat, you all! Turn it up the heat! Oh! Uncle Vartark, I need advice on seducing Alex the executive as fast as possible. Like Hitch. I have to get it done quickly so I make it to my date with Tina before she has sex with DeAndre. Mmm. <laughs> Welcome to the Encyclopedia Sextanica. First things first. We must do something about your wardrobe. Should have taken out my Prince Albert. 
Come on, let's go get some grubbing before we get to rubbing. Helmet, what in God's name are you doing dressed like that in public? You look like Al Pacino and cruising. I'm on a date, sir, with Alex from the EPA. I'm gonna have sex with her quickly to get the Marshland Preschool approved, then meet up with my wife to celebrate our anniversary. You want something that'll help your date go faster? Yes, yes, yes. These are from Petromundo's toy recall last year. We call them blackout beads. Bad for kids, but good for making them, if you catch my drift. Hmm? Hmm? You crazy SOB! Those were for your date. Keep up this behavior and we'll all be working for you one day. That is, if we survive the robot uprising. Thank you for escorting me, DeAndre. Hey, wait a minute. This is like a real execution? I thought this was gonna be like a club called Execution. Isn't it romantic? Balthy would have loved this. Here, would you mind putting this bag over your head? It won't be the first time DeAndre Brown bagged it. Oh! Ooh, here he comes. And he definitely looks guilty. Open the white burgundy, Balthy. I mean, DeAndre. This is not a memory future DeAndre will cherish. Welcome to the George Foreman Grill Grill. My name is George. What can I get you to drink tonight? I'll have bourbon on the rocks. His rocks. Pour it on his crotch and I'll lap it up like a stray cat. Meow. Oh. And for you, sir. Why is this menu threatening me with a knife? Ah! Chicken beast! Just bring us a spit bucket and some back tea. This guy's about to go 50 rounds with my J.J. Abrams. I'm sorry, Tina, but a brother can only take so much for a casual encounter. It's back to J-Date for DeAndre. doing here? I should be with my man on our special night. Yeah, you like getting weird in that grill? I got something else that'll leave marks on your meat. Are you ignoring me? Oh! I did. You laid killed Marshland. You sure get sloppy quick after one Cosmo. Should I call you Miranda? Because I would have made love to Miranda. All that red hair and sass. What do I need to do to get your attention, big boy? <laughs> no! So evil! They are naughty, aren't they? Marshland! Get the drill! Is that what you want? You want to drill me at the marshlands? That'd be kind of a thrill, wouldn't it, you said? Sadistic, hot mess. Most lands! I'll take my dinner in a doggy bag and can we put my date in the trunk? Oh, yes. Uh, we need a Matthew McConaughey special. DeAndre, get your whip and Tokyo drift me out of here. I've got to stop Bulbasaur. Oh, snap, jealous female. It's fast and furious time, yeah. <laughs> My whip is not death proof, Tina. Do you still have that bag by chance? What am I? Where's that? I'm. Where's this thing? I mean, it's car, the car perfect. I'm in the back of the car. What the? What are we doing at the Marshlands? Did we sign the papers? Not yet. We're just about to seal the deal. Stop, stop. 
Am I still hallucinating, or does this duck have a gorgeous set of teeth? All the animals are mutants here, thanks to you and your precious company. Really? A and that doesn't bother you? Nah, I'm dead inside after everything these eyes have witnessed. <laughs> Do you know what it's like to breastfeed a dying baby oyster because the oceans are so poisoned? I can't even imagine. Ah, it's horrible. No one cares about the environment except Al Gore, and no one listens to him because he's a chubby gay. I used to care, but you have no idea how evil humanity can be. Actually, I do have a fairly decent background with that. But you can change the world. Don't give up. Excuse me, pot to kettle. Over. You're having sex with me to turn these poison marshes into preschools. It's not worth it. These marshes are precious, and preschool children are precious. And you know what? My marriage is precious. So much preciousness. Deal off. No, pants off. <laughs> Balthas or Hun Bun Bun is here. I can smell it. Get your own damn man! No power, Tina! Look at our faces. We all look the same. What do you think, Erica? Should we break them up? Nah. Let's see if one of the tops comes off first. Yeah! Ah, oh, Erica, you're such a lazy cop. I gotta break it up. All right, ladies, enough fun. She's not human. She has a tail. She was flying. Sounds like you're flying, lady. Why don't you fly with us down to the station for a blood test? I'm going to come back and kill you all in your sleep with my irritable beaver. Did someone say irritable beaver? Tellman, what the hell is going on here? Why aren't you knee-deep in Alex sealing the deal? Sir, I was going to, and then I realized we cannot put a school on a toxic wasteland because there's something more precious going on here. <laughs> Hot corn! It looked like Mother Nature forgot her cotex. I don't know how you do it. I give you the task of getting the marshlands approved, and somehow you find oil. Well done, Hellman. I'm promoting you to senior advisor to the regional vice president of international mergers and acquisition analysis. Senior advisor to the regional... There it is. Oh, how did I manage to get promoted even farther from the drill? Balfi, I'm sorry I got so jealous. I guess picturing you with another woman made me more emotional than I expected. Sounds like a human thing to say. Do humans kiss like this? Oh, you are my marsh. You are my land. I am your home. You are my ham. Together, together we, we will make, make some sweet, sweet love, love together, together. together. Anniversary sweet love, love together. together. Oh, yes! Nailed it! Oh, yeah, we nailed it. <laughs> <laughs> what is a vegan demon's favorite food? Ooh, ooh, ooh. Yes, right here! The fake meat made from wheat gluten. Satan. <laughs> That's my name. Don't wear it out. <laughs> Shut your mouths. My jokes are for me only. And Mr. Mister. Mm. Oh. Justify your lives. Well, I got a promotion and learned that sexual harassment in the workplace is very real. It's incredible how far physical relations can get you up here. Wait, wait, wait. Are you saying that sex has power on Earth? Yes. Well, this is all news to me. Yeah? No, silly! Sex fuels the underworld. Who do you think invented it? 
Ooh, the Kardashian with the big badonka donk? Uh, you mean like all of them? <laughs> Actually, I'm rather keen on that one who looks like a man. She can back that thing up all over Necromuncula's <laughs> dirty little face. No, rude. Get to that drill. I'm serious. This is my serious face. I've got to go. My Apple Newton just booted up. I might play this new game called Tetris. Satan out. Happy anniversary, Balthy. Maybe we should skip the rest of dinner and have dessert upstairs. Oh. Do with me as you wish, my lady. Looks like you have a date with the Beach Boys and some good vibrations. <laughs> oh, Uncle Vlartark, I love you guys. <laughs> We love you. <laughs> Don't miss an all-new Neighbors from Hell next Monday at 10. Family Guy starts right now on TBS.